Hi, my name is Lee DeForth and I'm the city's comprehensive planner and I'm here today to talk to you about the city's redesignation as a bicycle friendly community at a bronze level. The League of American Bicyclists is a national organization and they designate communities throughout the nation um, regularly um, after reviewing very extensive applications and so we're excited to announce that um, this is a continuation of our designation. We've actually been designated since 2008. Of course, that the bar has moved. So in 2008, what we needed to do to be a bicycle-friendly community at the bronze level was a little bit less than what we need to do um, these days. But um, we're, we're excited and, and that designation, you know, in and of itself may not mean a lot to the average, um, the average bike rider or cyclist, but um, what it what it means to us and, and why we think it's important is because as part of that designation process, we provide a large amount of data and do a good, good amount of research to submit to the bicycle friendly um, communities application panel through the League of American Bicyclists and it's a lengthy application and it goes over things like equity and um, safety and we look at um, bicycle and pedestrian fatalities and accidents. We look at um, the infrastructure that has been installed since our last application and the infrastructure overall. We look at um, the types of services that are available to bicyclists and um, commuter commuters in the city. And, and so it really helps us benchmark our progress. And the other thing that's really great about this application process and the part that they haven't actually um, updated yet is we receive a report card when we are designated. So um, it's a it's a quick, usually one or two sheet report card that um, provides us some really good formative goals for coming four year period that have been measured against all of these other communities. So there are um, over 480 bicycle friendly communities in the nation. And so when um, the League of American Bicyclists is looking at our application and, and working with um, local advocates and reviewers as well. They're also looking at what other communities have found to be successful, um, where other communities have found they, um, they need to focus. And, and so that really helps us kind of refocus our efforts and, and double down as we move forward into our coming years. So um, we're really excited about this redesignation. It's, um, it's not an easy process and, it, and it's very meaningful um, to us and we are um, really thankful for those of you who during the reapplication process uh, participated in the Bicycle Friendly America Community Survey because um, that's one of the ways that the League of American Bicyclists receives feedback on our reapplication process. So thank you if you took that survey and um, stay tuned uh, to the city's website for updates on, on biking and walking in Columbia. If you haven't and you'd like to, you can certainly sign up for our Walk Bike Columbia um, newsletter. We send those announcements relatively regularly every every month or so, and it will provide some um, opportunities for engagement, certainly not as many events right now, but, um, but certainly as we're looking at projects that SCBOT is taking on, those opportunities for comment, we're trying to keep folks apprised of those as well. So. Um, if you haven't, check that out and thank you for joining us.